That's nice. You know, you're not being paid by the hour. Get to work. Hey guys, what's going on here? My name is Vorli and I welcome you to this video. You came here because of tips and tricks? Okay, so let's cut all unnecessary bullshit and let's dig our way right into it. What can you expect from this piece of my edit crap? Today we are going to talk about what is your goal as a scout, how to move better in your environment, what is the best weapon to choose and why, and lastly, weak points on enemies and prioritizing your targets. Now, our first topic. What is your goal as a scout? Please guys, if you could take only one advice from this video, let it be lighting. Light it up. I will repeat it, yeah. Lighting. That's the most important job of Scout. You know how annoying it is to play for other classes and can't see a shit because your so-called Scout is just jumping around on his grappling hook like a monkey and not paying attention about what's going on? Please, don't be this kind of Scout. It's really annoying. Second most important thing, what you have to do for your team is pick all possible Nitra and get it as soon as possible to your mule. In other words, ammo management. Be so kind and use your grappling hook wisely, please. Bring by it value to other team members. They will be thrilled. Maybe they even let you to pet their Steve. And you surely want that because he's a cuddle. By the way, if you are enjoying this video so far, please be that kind person and hit that subscribe button because I am aiming to cover much more stuff of Deep Rock Galactic such as guides, gameplays, fun moments and stuff. Also, I'm a great guy. Yeah, and don't forget ring the bell too. Lola loves it. Okay. Actually, the most important part is up top. Uh, is that? Yes, yay. Okay. Now, let's back to the video. Next topic we got a movement. If you don't have an engineer, it's a little bit more complicated to mine and gather hardly accessible minerals. But you can use your power attack to dig a little hole up there and be able to mine it comfortably. Don't forget that gravity is a bitch, so always do this on lower end of the wave. Yesterday I was also told by my friend that enemies don't support movement on particular materials such as these trees. He told me also about some others, but I don't remember them. Just use these trees for now, rookies. Third thing what I got on the list is the overclocked shotgun. This thingy can actually help you a lot during fights and environment movement. Although, how to get it, mm, that's another story. I don't want to speak about it in separate video, so let's do it right now. First, you have to promote your scout. The fastest way how to promote your character is by doing double XP missions. Even with that, you will spend on it about 10 hours, so get ready for that. When you finally reach level 25, you have to do next 4 assignment missions. If you're doing it whole day like me and right before midnight, when you are drained to death, you realize it, then you wanna kill yourself. Don't do it that way. So my advice for you guys, when you reach level 25, be cool, take a step back and these missions do with your secondary character because on scout you don't get more experience since you get maxed out level. But we are absolutely not done yet guys. Then you have to find the overclock in some of the deep dives. When you discover blueprint, you need to go next to bar and forge it. Then you have to stick it into your goddamn shotgun and voila! Yeah, that was in French. You can finally play with it. Ah, oh, that's it, let's move on. We are getting almost to the end, but not yet. The best weapon and why? In my opinion, without any doubt, it is M1000 Classic. The spray gun has many benefits, what you couldn't find anywhere else, such as the precision shot, respectable fire rate and the sexiest sound of all guns in the game. Just listen to it. I personally prefer damage over ammo amounts or clip size. Also the stun effect on this gun is pretty useful, it can time to time get you out of the trouble. 
Now the grenades. Well, if you are really cool, you choose cryo grenades. That's right. <laughs> yeah. For many reasons, but mainly because the other sucks. Period. And next step, we get the weak points on enemies and prioritizing targets. It's pretty obvious, even without overthinking it. What chance you shoot? Now, because of your great mobility as a scout, you should use your grappling hook to getting better angles for harder enemies such as Oppressor or Dreadnought. About prioritizing targets, you should be on track of menaces, Macteras and all of the spitting scum who can crawl out of the walls and surprise your colleagues from behind. If you use the best gun in the game, such as me, and you can aim reasonably well, not as me. You should be able to kill every danger in 100 meters around you and blink of the eye, even for harder difficulties. And now the bonus info. Yeah, you wish that, right? Perks. Alright. We got deep pockets, because you don't want to grapple that ledge two times, right? Second wind, because you got to go fast. Born ready, because if you snooze you lose, in other words, I dislike reloading the shotgun or frail, 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 flare gun. <laughs> then you get dash, because you need to go double fast from A to D, skipping B and C. And finally, the field medic, because you are the only one who can save your stupid ass team when they die on hazard 4. Just like yesterday in the new biomes, man. I scream, regroup, we need ammo to kill that weed, and the others, oh, no, 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 no. Don't give a shit. Ah, but anyway, that's everything for today, guys. I hope you liked it. Just fast conclusion for the end. Best takeaway of this video, be sure to always light it up and always hold your team up with ammo pouches. Feel free to hit that subscribe button for more DRG videos. Thank you very much for watching, have an amazing day. And don't forget that we fight, we mine, for Rock and Stone. The Memorial Hall is where we honor the fallen. Feel free to walk around and pay your respects.